Hello guys, welcome back. Um, today I'm going to be doing another ring pour. And I've got a 16 by 20 inch canvas. Going to be needing about 300 or 325 moles. So what I have is my white mixed with satin enamel and it's pretty thick and I have brown which I've made up with purple and yellow and a bit of black and we'll go in with some white first so I'm just going to layer my paints I don't really want my brown and my white to mix, that's why I'm going so carefully. And we'll go in with some more white. And I'm just going to end it off with a little bit of brown. That's um, 300 moles. And just chop, uh, popping the <laughs> chopping the bubbles, popping the bubbles, because I'd rather do it before than after, so I don't make those little white um, bubbles. Just layer some white paint around the edges. So this is very thin, thinned out white paint. And that's really to stop it from rolling over itself. And I'll just use what's left here <coughs> just to put on the corners.
<laughs> Sorry, I know you're off camera. I'm just um, tilting. Right, which way to go? So I'm just looking at um, the composition. Making a decision. I just want to bring this back. <laughs> so this is really stretching it out. There's a lot going on here. I really like it. I think <coughs> what I need to do though is add some dark just to balance it out, dark into the corners. So yeah, let's do that. Add a little bit there. I think I like it. Let's do a bit here. Yeah. Okay guys, um 
Unfortunately, I see a lot of bubbles, so I'm going to have to torch it again. And I didn't really want to do that because it brings up more of these little white these spots or speckles. Hmm. Because all those little speckles are actually going to turn into like little cells really. And there's a lot of them. Okay guys, I'm going to bring you down for a look. Alright guys, so this has been sitting for a short while. And I really, really like it. I think it's turned out absolutely beautiful. Look at that. That actually, to me, I don't know, um, it kind of looks like a wave. Comment below, you know, what do you think? It really looks um, very nice. And the depth between these rings is great. So I'll just show you from another angle as well. I'm really happy with the way this turned out. And I think I figured out why it is, or how come it is, that I get these little planet kind of um, cells forming here, like that. And, and I'll tell you in the, probably in the next video why. Look at that. How awesome. I absolutely love the way this turned out. When you look at it from this angle, it could be that it's all that this part is all like standing up. Well, guys, thank you very much for watching, and um, please don't forget to like and subscribe and share. Would appreciate that, and. Um, Please check your notifications bell and make sure that it's all turned on so that you get notified for my future videos. Thanks guys, thank you for watching. Bye.